Hi, I'm Rhonda Brown here with Tom Grotta. We are co-curators at Brown Grotta Arts in Wilton. Welcome to a video view of our fall 2021 Art in the Barn exhibition, Japandi, Shared Aesthetics and Influences. In the last few years, designers and writers have coined a term, Japandi, that refers to artistic approaches shared by artists from Scandinavia and Japan. The elements of Japandi include an integration of nature and natural materials, near reverence for exquisite craftsmanship, an admiration for repurposing, a respect for old and cherished items, and a preference for neutrals, primary colors, clean lines, and under ornamentation. Japandi Shared Aesthetics and Influences features more than 150 pieces by 39 artists working in Japan, Sweden, Norway, Finland, and Denmark who share these sensibilities in their artwork. As you enter the gallery, you'll find objects from Japanese artists made of repurposed Tokyo phone book pages and plated cedar. The hangings of sisal are from Sweden, the natural indigo weaving is from Japan, and the weaving of Japanese linen and knotted threads is from Denmark. On the far wall, a jacquard tapestry by noted Danish weaver Greta Sorensen is next to a bamboo sculpture by Jiro Yanazawa, who is a winner of the Coatsen Bamboo Prize. The sculpture echoes the lines in the imagery of Sorensen's Tokyo Nights. Above the stairs is black 15 boxes made of electroplated and painted stainless steel mesh by Jin Suk So. So is Korean, has taught and curated there, but she has also studied and curated in Japan and most of her professional life she has lived in Sweden. Her work is an amalgam of those influences, colors influenced by Swedish frost and northern lights, her methods by Japanese manozukuri, which means craftsmanship, but also putting the soul into the making of the work. We've installed the works in this exhibition to highlight the similar sensibilities that we see among them, hoping that viewers will see similarities as well. Here are three metallic works, a drawing of Japanese steel safety pins from Tomiko Kawada, a 3D landscape of spun stainless steel by Kyoko Kamai, whose work was the subject of a solo exhibition at MoMA, and a relief by Agneta Hoban of Finland of layered gold and silver leaf. In the center of the room, you'll see vessels by Gertrude Halls of Norway, combined with ceramics by Yasuhisa Koyama. Hall's work is new to Brown Garda Arts, but she well illustrates our theme of cultural affinities. Among the influences for her diaphanous vessels are time she spent in Japan, an interest in Buddhism and Shintoism, and her study of the Volupsa Song of Sibyl, one of the most important epic poems in Norse mythology. There are complex works of plated paper from Nori Hadakiyama in Japandi, one of which you can see here displayed next to a series of fans of stainless steel mesh and mica by Agneta Hoban a traditional Japanese shape rendered in Nordic cool. A major work in the exhibition is a large collage of Indian newspapers and lacquer by Japanese artist Toshio Sekiji. Sekiji explores the merge of cultures with repurposed newspapers, maps, and book pages. New stories are created atop the old by reading the strips of papers and lacquer enhanced areas. In Japan, we have also included classic art pieces like this resale work of wrapped thread and metal bows by the late Masakazu Kubayashi, who was brought to our attention by artist Sheila Hicks. His work and the other intentionally selected pieces by artists like Kari Stiansen, Kei Sekimachi, Chiyoko Tanaka, Jane Balsgaard, and Hisako Sekijima underscore an essential reason for Japan's popularity. The work is timeless and promotes a sense of balance and harmony for many viewers. Below the Kobayashi are works by Masako Yoshida that incorporate thread. Here is hand stitching on bark. Above, more handwork, meticulously embroidered panels by Asa Leonis of Norway, whose work has been acquired by two major museums in Europe in 2020 and 2021. In the area we call the Den and Old Kitchen, we have assembled smaller and larger works from Danish artist Greta Whitrock's The Second Cousin of Twisted Paper, to a work of Kabiso silk by Kiyomi Iwata. Above the server are two woven panels, Distress with Brick by Chiyoko Tanaka of Japan. Also a wooden vessel by the late Marku Kasonen, a Finnish artist. In the living room, we've paired weavings by Greta Sorensen of Denmark and June Tomita of Japan, each representing a bold color palette. We've also combined a gold toned sculpture by Kiyoko Kamai, a brightly colored sisal wall work by Mia Olsen of Sweden, and a rattan basket by Norwegian American artist Kari Loning. Other works grace the walls, the table, and shelves, including Reserve by Anne Henriksen, in which the image is created by weaving with non-slip rubber matting. On the floor, an ethereal sculpture by Naoko Serino in a transformative use of jute, best known as a durable material for heavy nautical ropes. 
At Brown Grotta Arts, art is found in all spaces, including bathrooms, kitchens, offices. Above the main kitchen family room, a paperwork by Greta Whitrock. In the kitchen, works by Asa Leonis, Gudrun Pagder of Denmark, Sariko Tanakawa, and Keiji Neo of Japan, among others. Moving into the office, there are a series of boat-like sculptures by Jane Balsgaard, in which she has merged twigs and handmade paper, sometimes from Japan. There are three very different interpretations of paper as an artistic material on the metal wall. A twisted paper construction of Floris Paper Marmergic Winquist of Finland, works of woven paper and lacquer by Toshio Sekiji of Japan, and paper woven with thread by Eva Vargo of Sweden. On the desk, is a tower by renowned Japanese-American artist Kei Sekimachi. Behind the desk is another ceramic by Yasuhisa Koyama. Koyama was one of the Japanese artists exposed to Nordic designers and Scandinavian taught teachers early in his career. Thanks for joining our quick tour of Japandi shared aesthetics and influences. To learn more about the essence and origins of Japandi and our artists' experience and opinions on affinities in these cultures, you can order the Japandi catalog at browngrata.com. In addition, the complete Japandi exhibition collection of artworks will appear exclusively on Artspur from October 4th through October 31st.